everybody, I am here today with an unboxing, or should I say, unbagging of a Peppermint Fox um, order, and I am really excited. I am just going to open this as I talk, uh, so that way the video is not super duper long. Basically, I've never ordered one of their clothing pieces before, I've only ever ordered brooches, um, their wooden pins. So I was really excited to try their dress the first time I got the moon thing. Let me look it up real quick. It is called the Collectionnaire d'Etoile Signature Dress Moonlight in Ivory, size 2. Um, and the... I'm on my computer right now. If you can't tell, I'm trying to find the other thing I got. I got a dress and I got a brooch. Anyways, it is a, well, you'll see it. It'll be a surprise. Uh, so it is their collaboration, their moon print with all the astrological um, signs and constellations, blah, blah, blah. It was really pretty. And I was super duper excited to try it on for the first time, so I thought I'd give you a little bit of a review of their dresses and their pins, if you're curious. Um, they tend to have a really decent uh, resale value, so if you're interested, it might be a good idea to match another quality before you buy. How do I open this? We're, we're just gonna we're just gonna cut the top open very carefully so I don't cut my dress. There we go. Ah. And it's free. This also doesn't tell me what it's called. So everything comes in a lot of clear plastic packaging. I like it, but it's a lot of wasted plastic. So here is the pin. It's this gorgeous, like, framed here. Let me shine this. So you can see um, the texture of the painted, well, painted glossed wood, whatever you want to call it, um, with the phases of the moon. It's gorgeous. Um, let me take this off so you can see the back of it. So this is the back. I really, really prefer this type of pin back to the little rolly ones. Those are so annoying. I might, I might even wear this, uh, wear this one today. What do you think? I really like it. Um, I mean, their quality is great. I don't know. Uh, how do you give a review for a pin? I don't know. It's great. Feels nice. It arrived on time. It looks like it was supposed to. I got a hair clip too. Okay. Awesome. So I got the dress, a hair clip for free. I don't remember seeing this on the listing. So that's really nice of them. I guess I could wear it anywhere technically. And a cream colored ribbon, which actually really doesn't match the dress at all. Uh, so I will not be wearing that. But here's the dress in size 2, and I will put it on the mannequin for you to see. And it's gorgeous. I am loving it. It is definitely an ivory, which I love. I was a little bit worried that it would be kind of like the yellow or like bluish purple, like the other one, their gray version. But no, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous shade. Um, it's a little bit wrinkly, so I apologize. The top fabric is super thick quality cotton. Like it's not like baby's um, thick cotton where you can really see the grains. Um, not the grains, <laughs> this is not wood. Uh, the threads, but this is a really smooth thick cotton. So it's definitely high quality. I love that. And the top, the bodice is fully lined. That's always amazing. See, the skirt has invisible seams, which is also really nice, um, although you probably don't care all that much. On the inside, there's lots of loose threads, um, but nobody cares. Um, the zipper has a little um, clasp at the top to make it easier to zip by yourself if you don't have help. Because uh, let's be honest, not all of us have handmaidens to dress us every morning. One thing that's a little bit off-putting about Peppermint Fox is their shipping. Um, 
the shipping is expensive, but I ordered this right before they launched their um, US slash international store, so I cannot vouch for their new international interface. Um, but the thing that kind of bugs me a little bit about Peppermint Fox, that is not a criticism, but just forewarning you guys, they ship it and then they send you the tracking, so it's, it's usually like off by a little bit, so you don't get your tracking number email until way later. Like when I got this tracking number for this order, I also got my tracking number, or not the tracking number, but the your order has shipped email for the last order I did several months ago. Um, so that was a little bit weird. So yeah, and one thing that I really, really, really love about Peppermint Fox 2 is, and I did it for this order as well, um, because it was kind of an impulse buy, actually, is that they let you do layaway. So it's kind of like a payment plan where you buy it, and then you have 45 days to pay it off in increments on PayPal. So that's really, really nice. Um, especially because this was a pre-order, so it allowed me to basically pay it off until they shipped it. So that was very convenient, awesome, definitely encourages me to make larger orders on their website because I know I have, I can pace myself. That's it. I love Peppermint Fox. I hope you enjoyed seeing the details and my quick little teeny tiny review. I hope you enjoyed watching. Uh, make sure to like this video if you like my short little quick reviews of different brands and hauls so that I can do more. Anyways, hit that button, subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye!